welcome back to my channel my name is Kristen and this is life made simple and I have a blog called life made simple dot blog this video is going to go hand in hand with a blog post that I wrote about my daughter's closet makeover and organization so if you have any questions make sure you go over and check out the blog post I will have it linked down below in the description and check out there, I will have links to all the products that I used, the paint colors that I used. There will be more information in that blog post. I'm going to give you a rundown a little bit on her room before I get started. It is the smallest room in the house and there is not a lot of storage. There is just not a lot of places to put anything. I pretty much have her small dresser. She has one just like this. This is my toddler's room that I'm in right now, but she has a dresser the same size, exact same one. She has her closet and then she has under her bed pretty much for storage. And I like things to look put together, clean, not cluttered. So when I switched her room, because she currently wasn't in that room, I decided I'm going to go ahead and paint her closet because it was all off-white, gross, the trim needed painted, the walls needed painted, the shelves needed painted. So I did that and I will put my before picture here. It's not a like super amazing Pinterest worthy before picture, but that's just because I had nothing in that closet before I moved her in there since we were swapping rooms. So that's when I had decided it was a good time to stop and paint it. So it went from this off white color to the color of her room in bright white. And then I went ahead and organized it and that is where we will get into the video. So I hope you guys enjoyed and make sure you pop over to the blog to read everything about this closet and all the sources will be linked there. So that will be down in the description. And if you're new, please subscribe. I will be doing more content like this along with some random vlogs and a lot of home projects and home renovations and a couple grocery hauls here and there. So if you like it, please hit the like button and don't forget to subscribe. Thanks. Okay, so I said I would show you how big this room is. It is super tiny, so don't mind the tape. I'm still, like I said, painting all the trim white. So you walk in and I have my camera set up over there, but the closet is to your left. You have this mess going on here. Her room is not completely done yet, but it is how it is for now. Hopefully that doesn't blind you. And then literally there's her crib. That's the door that we walked in and that's behind it. So there really is not a lot of room whatsoever in here. So the only storage solutions that I have is under her crib and her dresser, which the two bottom ones well, pretty much all of them. Like, they have their own system going on there. That can be another video. If you are interested, comment down below and let me know. I have a three-tier, which I don't have much on here right now. And then this is her closet. Up here in this basket, I have all her bows. And then that's just like where all her baby stuff that we wanted to keep that is like memories. We keep it in there. I have these organization baskets up here and this is just kind of, I don't know, overflow for right now. I mean, it is just random stuff. Like I have crib sheets in here. Um, swim diapers that probably don't fit her yet this is some swim stuff uh, like one of those mosquito nets that go over a pack and play and then this is like all the inserts that you would put like when you buy items like strollers and car seats and you got like the newborn inserts so those are that and my plan is to keep them up there and then when it comes time to get rid of that item and we don't need it anymore then I will get those down and then I think that's probably the same thing. So that's all I have in there for right now. And I'm trying to think of a better system, but at this age for her, that works best. Now here, so we have like, we, she only has the one hanging bar, which is fine because I only hang up her clothes that are her size right now or about to be her size. 
Um, and then the rest is in a bin in the spare bath or bathroom, spare bedroom. This basket, I have wipes, which we are low on, but this is where I put all the wipes. And then when I need new ones, I just pull them out. This is just a bin of like swaddle blankets, I think. And I actually can go ahead and probably use this for something else because she is not in swaddle blankets anymore. And then we have extra space right there. This is our travel diaper bag. I just keep it here. We don't use this on a daily basis because it's so big. And then pretty much everything in here is literally toys that is meant for her age. Like just hand-me-down toys from Emma and I'm going to get a better system. I actually, this weekend, I wanted to go through all of these toys and figure out what I can go ahead and get rid of because like she doesn't use the tummy time mat anymore and we just don't need some of these things. But like I said, she doesn't have that much stuff. All the rest of her clothes are literally in all these drawers and blankets and shoes, all that is in there, diapers, all the creams, all in that top drawer. So this is how I have her toys organized for now and just wipes and her clothes and her books. And then this is the clothes hamper that we just put all their dirty clothes in. And usually she has a hat hanging up there. There it so. is. I literally hardly ever close the doors on this closet because I just think it looks so pretty. So, and I know that this is just a stage in life. Like this is just how her closet is going to look right now because she's going to grow and things are going to change and she's going to get new things so i thought i wanted to document this as it is now before it changes if you like this type of video and you want to see more small projects that i have done around the house please comment down below and let me know or give this video a thumbs up that way i have an idea of what you guys like to see i hope you enjoyed this video and there will be a blog post that will go along with this reveal so if there's anything in this closet that you want to know where i got it or what color you know the paint is i think i had said it earlier but i'll have to double check if that's exactly what it was but if you're wondering anything check out the blog post because i will have all the items linked all the details will be linked in that blog post and i will put that down in the description and i will put the title or like the handle um, of my blog right here and follow me on Instagram because I am a very active over there I update very often and I'm on stories all the time. So pop over and say hello. Thank you so much Bye. You gotta listen up, listen up There's not a thing that I can get from you Boy, I don't need that much, need that much